Hello everyone, welcome here. Myself Shekhar Mitla and I am here going to share you a great lesson for you to learn very super easy techniques to um, like a master in your Excel skills. Yes, if you know how to ask a question, yes, you will be master on Excel. How? Let's see now. See, in this question, like a particular lecture, I'm going to share you like a Excel VLOOKUP formula how to write. Along with this, we are going to introducing like a open AI. It's an artificial intelligence tool. So this open AI, it's nothing but chart GPT. So the chart GPT is a non-profit open source code. Write what you want and get the answer immediately. Getting better every day. This chart GPT open AI is a getting better every day. And what you want to know and test, yes, you test it. Let's see now, for writing VLOOKUP, what is VLOOKUP in Excel? Yes, using VLOOKUP, when we need to find the things from a table or a range by row, we'll use VLOOKUP formula or function to get the information. How we to write this VLOOKUP and how to test? Let's see now, very super easily, I'll write this VLOOKUP. See here, these are the like uh, expenses and budgeted like a uh, one, two, three, four, five items are here and uh, five items are won't be here for the budget ex like uh, estimated. Now see here like if I enter like a food item I want to get this price like what is the budget I want to know. If I change the car item I want to know the output like uh, what is the car budgeted amount it is. Maybe it is a four items we can see if it is a lakhs of items how Yes, we look lookup will really help you by writing in this way. To know the function, first I'll write a formula. And if you prepare a query, how to prepare using chart GPT automation, I'll show you. Got it? Let's see now. See here for food. I have taken this food item out of this box items only. I have taken for food here. And I'm implementing the like uh, current cell. This particular cell I want to get an output. So this cell I'm selecting. And here you can also write the function like a formula or here also you can click it and equal to we look up press tab to like uh, complete the formula with the open parenthesis got it open parenthesis and what is the value to be look up what is the value to be like what is the cell item or it may be out of these items or if you want to change dynamically in this particular a8 cell you just select the a8 I want to change later and I want to make it dynamic formula. So I'm changing like uh, this selection I have done. Now, comma, see here it is a lookup value, comma, table array from where the range you have to specify. And comma, column index position, yes. Which position data item you want to get written. Yes, column index position means A column, B column from the table it is there. So A column is index number 1, B column is index number 2. So we will specify 2. From the 2 we are getting a written value. That's it. Got it? Now, see, like uh, A8, comma, the range we have to specify now. So the range I am going to specifying from A22, the B6, I am sorry, A22, B6 range we have to specify. So A column, the lookup and written we need to get from the B column now. So A, A2 colon B6 done. Okay. So the range is finished. Like headers are not required to add. If added no issue but it's not required. And make sure to concentrate on data itself. Now put a comma. What is the next value? Index position like a, what is the table? It is a having like 2. Like a, A is a 1 column. B is a index position number 2. So specify 2. Put, make sure to look up uh, like a range lookup it is saying no put a comma true false it is asking true is nothing but approximate match and false is nothing but exact match what you require exactly if it is matched then only I want to get the data I don't want approximate matches here at present so put a right F A L S E false clearly you can write the false and close the end parenthesis hit enter Yes, something is else here. F A. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. F A L S E. False statement. If it is written, yes, definitely you won't, you won't get data properly. So food. 
awesomely accurately this column you may check it 150 we are getting if i change to car which is the data is available what is the item expenses item is available i'm changing the same item so if i hit enter in the car area i'll get 180 automatically awesomely we have a prepared a formula so we are getting and now let me check with the shop shop wow and it's a case sensitive strongly remember it's a case sensitive all you have to put something you know like uh, this particularly uh, if it's a small uh, shop if i entered properly you won't get it you may check it car okay now it is taking like maybe like it's a like a ms excel it's a 2021 the latest version we are doing let's check it earlier i have uh, practiced this uh, i faced this experience so if it is coming means really awesome not mean like a case sensitive it will follow sometimes got it now we are accurately getting perfectly awesomely we are getting now how to know and how to write these formula if you don't know how to write what is the criteria you have to follow these are the things if you don't know see i am taking a copy of this formula i am taking a copy of this formula and just i am taking here and i am pasting here just hit and enter this is the formula got it just i have taken so now just simply i am deleted that uh, result set and formula got it now see jart gpt is a non-profit open source and uh, write once and I, I asked you to write once and what you want to get the answer immediately no i'll see and we will test it now so the same formula is it coming from the like chart gpt or not we are going to test it so let's see for that formula query how i am writing write a formula in excel that searches for the value in cell 8 a8 this is the value to be searched from this see a8 see a and 8 cell it is in columns a2 to b6 a2 here and b6 is this is here so this is the range i am telling in my query so in the column a2 to b6 then returns the value in column b then return the value in column b got it use we look up function i have written my query so let me select this query before uh, selection and uh, taking this query uh, what you need to do go to google and uh, check chart gpt hit enter yeah chart gpt hit enter yes see this is the chart gpt optimizing languages model for dialect try chart gpt yeah it's uh, experiencing uh, like a overload let's try once again wow it's really awesome it's coming welcome to chat gpt and if you are new to here you just sign up like a create an account and also you just go to login with your like a google account free as of now it is free or microsoft account okay so i just i'm continuing with the google account so select any one of your gmail account which is uh, available or microsoft account or you can create yes we are here log in now here it's a chat gpt examples explain the quantum computer information or how do i make http request javascript using any function python calculator program using uh, like uh, uh, python or javascript any language if you want the same way we are writing this particular excel formula query let's see this query should be right in this box so paste here just hit here for chart how we will send the chart See, write a formula in Excel, such as have a, uh, written, <laughs> what it is happening? Equal to VLOOKUP A8, cell, A2 and range, 2, false. What we have written there, and more than me, it is explaining me even what is the explanation, how the formula is written. How the formula is written, what you need, what you need other support. So just take a formula, just take a, take a copy of this formula. What do you call it as formula or formula? Just come back to our Excel. Come back to our Excel, this cell, and go to paste over here. Yes, let's check. We look up A8, comma A2. The range it is 2 for index position. False. Hit enter. Am I written any formula line, single line? Over now, over now here. Let's check the data. Let's check the data. Car. 180. Hotel. 545 awesomely what you need more to you should get in a master 
what you need the formulas you can get using excel we look up whatever it like a formula you want to test you just test it your way so practice more and more in such a way of uh, you will be making really awesome awesomely see the same formula i have pasted here earlier the same formula we are getting from like automation try yourself we'll catch you in next one thank you